In the 50s and 60s, Nigeria was the largest exporter and producer of palm oil. According to Index Monday, Nigeria now ranks the fifth highest producer in the world after Indonesia, Thailand, Malaysia and Colombia. The World Bank says Nigeria consumed approximately three metric tons of fats and oils in 2018, with palm oil accounting for 44.7% or 1.34 million metric tons, which makes Nigeria Africa's largest consumer of palm oil products. The challenges of palm oil production is better told by the farmers themselves. Eddie Obasuyi has a farm in the outskirts of Benin. He believes that they could do with more help from NIFA. For quite a while now, there's no really synergy between NIFA and the oil palm producers in this um, locality. Ideally, we ought to look up to NIFA for guidance in this oil palm business. But um, as of now, I can't remember when last I even visited NIFA or NIFO even um, tried to kind of contact the oil palm growers around this um, area. We, then we bring the, the wasted work here. Rehae Udo's farm is located at Urokosa Umude local government area of Edo State. He agrees with Mr. Obasui. According to him, self-help is the driving force. So all this farm you see now, I'm the one who planted it, I would line it and planted it. I would not con consult anybody from Nifo. I did it myself. I only go there and bought the seeds and come here and plant, that's all. Nifo's core mandate is to conduct research into the production and products of oil palm and other palms of economic importance and transfer its research findings to farmers and the research body's executive director in Benin strongly believes that they have not in any way failed to deliver accordingly. We are providing the right quality seed. The seed that we provide now, for instance, can mature in two and a half years. It uh, does, uh, in the first one year of harvest, you can do, get as much as eight tons per hectare of uh, fruit. And you can actually drive that, that to about 25 tons in about eight years of, uh, of production per, per hectare. We also train um, farmers. Then we uh, now, for small, very small scale farmers, we fabricate equipment for them for the process. There is more. NIFO's head of agronomics and farm manager explains that over two decades of research have yielded seedlings that can compare to the best in the world. The hybrid that we have now, the Tenera hybrid that we have now, is a crossing of the Presifera with the Dura. So the Dura parents is the parents that we have improved on all over. Yeah, it is not a one day job. This, the, the, the Pisivera and the Dura period that we prove on have taken us much less than 28 years. So, if there is anything they think that they will bring from outside the country that can compete with our uh, material, let them come. We will tell them that no, our is still better than what they are bringing from outside the country. Nigeria's annual requirement for palm oil is about 2.5 million metric tons, while only 1.25 million metric tons, or 50%, is domestically produced, leaving a gap of 1.25 million metric tons that is filled through importation, giving rise to foreign exchange exposure of $500 million annually.